Hello and welcome back to the official channel of books. PDF is an essential file formatter, well known for its fixed style and content display capabilities. Whether you're reading school papers or reviewing work documents, chances are you're reviewing them in PDF. But PDF has a simple yet notorious flaw. Their content can be difficult to read. With a fixed, unadaptable layout, text is sometimes hard to follow, especially when the wording is sized too small or in a crooked form. So it is important to use the best device for viewing PDFs so that you can read with ease. Books has 14 years of dedicated experience as an e-paper tablet maker, and we know how to make the most of effective PDF reading. There are hidden gems within Books' PDF reading tools that you're probably not aware of. Let's take a look. The first feature we'll highlight is our exclusive split screen mode. Not only can you view two windows horizontally, but also in a vertically split screen. Everyone's first thought when it comes to dual windows is multitasking. Taking notes while reading a book is indeed the most convenient and common use of this feature. However, you can do a bit more than you think in a split screen view. Try selecting current doc only in any of these four modes and read one document in two windows simultaneously. The current doc and another doc mode also allows you to read two different files on one screen. If you like taking notes while reading a book, you cannot miss out on the doc and notepad mode. The last option, doc and translation, is ideal for reading files in foreign languages. Since PDF has a fixed layout, its text can be too small to read at times. In this case, the PDF reflow comes into play. When you open this feature within a PDF, you can change your selected text's font size, boldness, spacing, and even the typeface. This fixes difficult to read text quickly and comfortably. But you may wonder, does PDF reflow work when a file has more than one column with several pictures and charts? In this case, choose article mode. In article mode, the interface can be divided into two to nine grids, and you can adjust the size and spacing of the grids to make them perfectly fit the layout of the PDF. For example, in this doc, we're dividing the interface into four grids. As you see after adjusting the order, we can now easily read the file. What are your thoughts on article mode? Do the grids make the file noticeably better than the original? Many PDFs are created by scanning images. We usually can't select any text or change the layout of this type of picture-based PDF. However, we have a secret weapon for you, the OCR tool. Use OCR to highlight, underline, translate, and even listen to text inside messages. Many textbooks in PDF are converted from scanned pictures making typography sloppy and incoherent. To combat this, use the OCR tool to help identify the text and have it automatically read aloud. The Doctrine of the Sphere. 6. Convenient way of regarding the matter. We may consider the celestial sphere as mathematically infinite in its dimensions, then. Our devices also support a quick search mode. Its first option allows you to view the table of contents and then expand the table to read the full length of each chapter's headings. In addition to dragging the progress bar, you can look for content and thumbnails or jump directly to a specific page. It's even simpler if you're searching for a specific keyword. Just tap search and quickly locate the keyword. When reading PDFs, many times often we make highlights and handwritten notes, but organizing these annotations can become challenging. This is where Books enters the picture. Our device not only supports note-taking, but also lets you export them. 
you can export annotations in TXT format as well as handwritten notes in PNG and PDF format and share them on third-party apps and emails in just one tap. While reading PDFs is essential, transferring and receiving files is also necessary. What is the best way to import a PDF into a books? Aside from cable transfers, there are two other methods for quickly downloading PDFs and other files onto the device. You can start by using a third-party app. Because our ePaper tablets run on Android, you can freely install apps like Google Drive and from there download files. Another option is to use Bookstrop. Bookstrop allows easy transferring of files to books devices by simply dragging and dropping them. Not only can you do this on your computer, but also on your phone. And you only need the Books Assistant app. So no matter how many PDF files you need to import, you can always transfer them into a books tablet with ease. That's all for today's tips on viewing and engaging PDFs. For 14 years, Books has dedicated itself to seamless PDF reading and multi-document support. We've created a slew of special features to help make your reading and work more efficient. The tips we've shown today are only a part of the many things that Books tablets can do. Let us know what else you're interested in and tell us in the comments. And your suggestions could be featured in our next video. Thanks for watching. I'm John with Books. Until next time.